Hey y'all, I am Jill Gal here in Statesville, North Carolina. Today I wanted to talk to you a little bit about selling your house and how it is it's so important to make sure that your house is decluttered. And the reason for that is because other buyers that are coming in your home need to be able to see it as their home. And when you have a room that is so cluttered that they can't see what the room actually looks like, all they can see is your kids' knickknacks and toys and books. Well, if this buyer doesn't have kids, that's not appealing to them. They can't see that bedroom maybe as an office or a guest room. They can only see it as a nursery or a kid's room. And it is important that you're still living in the home and that you have to make that work for you. I'm not saying that you can't act like you don't live in it, but you need to be able to see it through a buyer's eyes. And what that means, well, a lot of times you'll hear me say that your house needs to be vanilla. And vanilla is such a just plain, middle of the road. It doesn't have to be boring. You can spice it up with things here and there, but it needs to appeal to the masses. And what I mean is if you are a china doll collector and you have curio cabinets full of china dolls, well, that may not appeal to a single guy who's buying a house. And so all he sees is your china dolls and china cabinets. He doesn't see a large wall that he could put a giant flat screen television on surround sound and football parties. That's not what he sees. So when you expose your walls and you make rooms feel bigger, it appeals to more people. So recently I was showing houses and this got, what got me thinking about it. Every room that we went into, the corners were so full, like everything was cram packed into that house. If that's your problem and you've grown out of your house, then you need to go rent a storage container or a storage unit and fill it up. Put all your stuff in storage. It's fine if it's gonna be there for a few months. It's not a big deal. You're gonna be moving to another house and then you can put your stuff in there. But the problem is your house is not, not gonna sell and you're certainly not gonna get top dollar if you don't get it decluttered and depersonalized. So anyway, those are my thoughts. If you have any disagreements or feel free to comment. I'm okay with that too. Uh, feel free to reach me at 704-657-5050 and you can always reach me at jillstatesfulhomes.co. Thanks so much. Have a blessed day.